Welcome to our tutorial on how to restrict access to specific applications in Windows 10. Sometimes, you may want to control which applications can be accessed on your PC for security or productivity reasons. In this guide, we'll walk you through the steps to restrict access to specific applications using the Local Group Policy Editor. Let's dive in. Hello there. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to restrict access to specific applications in Windows 10. Follow these simple steps to control the applications that can be run on your PC. Step 1. Let's begin by opening the Start menu. You can find the Start button located at the bottom left corner of your screen. Step 2. In the Start menu, search for GPEDIT and click on the top result to open the Local Group Policy Editor. Step 3. In the Local Group Policy Editor, browse the following path. User Configuration, Administrative Templates, System. Step 4. On the right side, Double-click the Don't Run Specified Windows Applications policy. Step 5. In the Policy Settings, select the Enabled option to activate the application restriction. Step 6. Click the Show button to specify the names of the applications you want to block. Make sure to add only one name per line and include the EXE file extension. Step 7. Confirm the names of the apps you want to block and ensure they are correctly specified. Step 8. Click the Apply button to save the changes you've made. Step 9. Finally, click the OK button to close the policy settings. And that's it! You have successfully restricted access to specific applications in Windows 10 using the Local Group Policy Editor. Congratulations! You have learned how to restrict access to specific applications in Windows 10. By following this step-by-step -step guide, you can now control which applications can be run on your PC for enhanced security and productivity. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you found it helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more helpful PC tips and tutorials. Enjoy managing application access and see you in the next video.